Mr. Otter Studio. Here's something you can do with all of that extra tissue paper you have lying around after birthdays, holidays. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make these tissue paper decorations. Hopefully you can get some ideas from this. These are the supplies that you'll need. You'll need some tissue paper, whatever color you wanna use, some scissors, and then you can use wire or a stapler to staple the middle of it. The more pieces of tissue paper you use, the puffier and fuller it's going to be. So get as many as you're gonna use. I'm using six. So get your tissue paper, and then we're going to fan fold it this way. And then we're gonna fan fold it so you fold this way, and then you fold back. Fold your paper up like a fan. Once you get it folded all together in a fan fold, so a fan fold looks like a fan, you wanna put either two staples in here or you can wrap wire around it, or use tape. So to find the middle, I just, just fold it in half. So we know the middle's right here, coming from this side, and then on this side. Once you put your staples in the middle or you tie tape around it or wire, cut these edges. You can cut it a few different ways. You can cut it into a circle, you can cut it into a point. So I'm gonna be cutting it into a nice rounded edge. Okay, so it kinda looks like this. Do the same thing on this side. Once you've cut the edges, you open it up and you're ready to start unfolding the crepe paper. Carefully, because this does, crepe paper rips really easily, so you wanna just slowly take your first side and pull it out. So you wanna fold these parts up. And I accidentally grabbed two pieces, but that's okay. Keep pulling each layer out and pressing it open. So open up a few on one side and a few on the other. So there is with six pieces, and then you flip it over, and we're gonna do the same thing on the opposite side. Pull open this side, pull open two, pull open two, and then finish with the middle sections. And if it does rip, that's totally fine, don't worry about it. After you've opened them all up, kind of look around it and see where you need to adjust it. There's this gap right here, so I'm just gonna kind of push that over into it. And then to hang it up, all you need to do is hook fishing string or some kind of string or wire right here, and then you can hang it up. This is what it looks like with six pieces of crepe paper. Okay, so let's say you only have two pieces of crepe paper. You could make a smaller one. To make a smaller one, we're just gonna fold it in half. Fold it in half this way. So then just cut them apart so you have eight pieces now instead of two. So we're gonna start fan folding it. Just decide how wide you want and just try to keep it about that width. Okay, and then you need to find the middle, so just fold it in half. Take your wire or your stapler, and you just wanna staple right in the middle. And then cut the edges, so on this one, maybe I'll make them pointed. Seems to work better if you cut a little bit further down on the side. Now we're gonna do the same thing, you're gonna open it up, open a few this way, a few this way, and then keep going until you're at the center. Okay, once you're done with one side, flip it over and start with the other one. As you can see, this is already really full just with that one side. So for this one, we had two big sheets of tissue paper. This one only had six. All right, so for this one, I'm using a white sheet of tissue paper and then two pink. So I have eight pieces of pink and then I have four pieces of white. Determine how wide you want it to be and then just keep that as your measurement. Okay, once you have it fan folded, when you use more tissue paper, your stapler, depending on how strong it is, may not go through it. So for this one, I'm actually gonna use some tape. I'm gonna find the middle of it by folding it in half, and then I'm just gonna take my tape and I'm gonna wind it around the center. So just so it holds it really nicely in the center. So you have a nice bow tie. Once you have the center taped or stapled or you've wrapped wire around it, we're gonna cut these edges. Let's just do these ones pointed. Just check it. We're gonna do the same thing we did with the other ones. Take the outside edges and fold them out first and then continue until we get to the very center. And that's it. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Have a wonderful day. We will see you around on YouTube.